Welcome to CBS Sports coverage of the NCAA Tournament. Today's game is between the Bison and the Kansas Jayhawks. Ladies and gentlemen, the Brack. And of course, our starting lineup. I'm curious to see how these matchups will unfold, Gus. The opening minutes will dictate how the rest of the game will be played. And of course, how the teams will set the tempo. Well, I think if they can focus on some of these keys here, they'll be in position to win. So here we go. On the outside. Shots up. Can finish. He knows how to operate down on the box. And he can step out and shoot the jump shot. His ability to step out makes him such a tough card, Gus. Who do you put on him, a big or a little? I want to thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Gus Johnson, and joining me, the man with all of the insight, the governor, Bill Rafter. Ah, he got it up and in. Now they work it around the perimeter. Fire! Squared up on the catch. Got his puppies in order. This layup is definitely worth a second look. Gotta make those guys. It's incredibly deflating when you don't. Collins receives the pass. He shoots from the right of the circle. Shots off. Flowers receives the ball. Jump shot. Nice. Taylor handles the feed. Fired. He missed it. Pulls it in. On the right side. Three minutes left on the game clock. Flowers handles the pass. Strips the ball. They work it around the perimeter. He shoots from outside. The senior. He can put up points and he can move the ball. This guy really thrives in almost any offensive system. Very versatile and a nightmare to guard. On the low block. Down the lane. Finger roll. So easy. on the right wing. Dials up a long-range shot. Oh! Two minutes left on the game clock. How about the action so far, Coach? Some good postseason tournament action. I'm certain the people watching are enjoying this one. Neither team backing down at this point. I'll tell you what makes the NCAA so special is the fact that it takes one bad night. One bad night, and your season is over. It's going to be a shame that when the final horn sounds, one of these very competitive teams will be out season will be over. Looking for the bomb. And no! Grabs the rebound. And he's fouled. Rap, it's been a great team effort for these guys. As a coach, it's great to see all five guys on the floor working together. That is impressive. That's how you win 
and win consistently does. When multiple people contribute, it takes the pressure off your superstar. And he lays it up and in. And they burn a timeout. We'll have more NCAA basketball coverage in a moment. And after the timeout, we're all set to pick things up. One minute left on the game clock. On the outside. And lays it in. Up and in. Ha -ha! They work it into a double team in the post. Shots off, takes the rebound. Way out on the right wing. Stolen. They work the perimeter. In the lane. And he can't get the bounce. Rips it down. On the left side. And it's blocked. This guy can light things up in a hurry. He's got a scorer's mentality. He's definitely a talent. You can relate to him uh, when it comes to putting the ball in the hoop, but he's got to be careful. You've got to remember to involve your teammates. And a look at our game summary will give you an idea of how these two teams are stacking up against one another so far. Here's a look at how both teams are doing with their keys to the game. 